Hey there, welcome to Long Mind Channel. If you're here first time watching me, I'm Devi Sundar, founder of Teletherapies. As Christmas approaches, a festival season of joy, light and togetherness. Today in the spirit of caring for our loved ones, let's unwrap a important topic that touches many lives, the connection between diabetes and COPD. Grab a cup of cocoa, cozy up, and let's delve into the intricate connection between the, these two health companions. Before we jump into the video, if you're not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button to get notified whenever I release any videos. Without any further ado, let's jump into the video. Imagine this, our health is like a symphony where chronic lung disease and diabetes play integrate notes. As Virgil, an ancient Roman poet said, the greatest wealth is health. Let's explore why this analogy is not just poetic, but also scientifically profound. In ancient times where Virgil lived, health was indeed a precious asset. The ability to lead a fulfilling life, pursue dreams and contribute to society depended heavily on one's health. Pass forward to today and the sentiment still holds true. In a modern first phase life, uh, the impact of chronic conditions like uh, lung disease and diabetes has become increasingly prevalent. These challenges are not isolated. They often intertwine and affect each other, creating the symphony of complexity within our bodies. Now let's consider chronic lung disease and diabetes as uh, two crucial instruments in this symphony. When one instrument is out of tune, it affects the entire composition. Recent studies suggest a bidirectional dance between the diabetes and chronic lung disease. It's not just about one affecting the other, but a dynamic interplay. Ever heard of COPD? Turns out diabetes not only increases the risk, but cranks up the severity of COPD. And asthma, have you ever heard about asthma being linked with diabetes? The evidence is crystal clear. Diabetes and Metabolic Syndrome Clinical Research and Reviews in 2018 explored the complex interplay between diabetes and COPD. The study revealed that diabetes not only increases the risk of developing COPD, but also worsens the progression and severity of the existing respiratory condition. And another study, uh, a cohort study published in the Lancet, Diabetes and uh, Endocrinology in 2015, examined the relationship between diabetes and asthma. The findings indicated that individuals with diabetes were more likely to develop asthma and asthma patients with diabetes exhibited more severe respiratory symptoms compared to those without diabetes. Now, looking into the research, we are now uh, clear that diabetes and chronic lung disease are integrally connected and the presence of one will influence the severity of the other and the progression of the disease itself. Think of it like a duo in a band, diabetes and lung disease. When one goes out of tune, the other follows. It's a harmonious and delicate balance uh, that we need to maintain between both the conditions in the management. Now let's talk about the solution. A holistic approach is essential in treating the health like a garden. Imagine this, the flower represents our lung and the soil our diabetes management. We can't neglect the flowers that's our lung and focus only on the soil that's the diabetes management, right? Let's look into the evidence, uh, what it says about the solution. A prospective study in the European Respiratory Journal in 2016 explore the impact of COPD on the glycemic control in patients with diabetes. The results demonstrated that individuals with coexisting COPD and diabetes experience more significant challenges in their glycemic control, emphasizing the need for a holistic approach to manage the comorbidities. Another study, Diabetes Care, in 2018, focused on the association between the interstitial lung disease. The study found that individuals with ILD had a higher prevalence of diabetes and the presence of ILD was associated with the increased risk of diabetes. This suggests that uh, a holistic health management should be applied in patients with the COPD and diabetes. Integrated care plans like a well-practiced melody combining respiratory exercises and tailored diabetes management leads to improved outcomes in patients uh, suffering from COPD and diabetes. To my fellow health professionals, it's time for a collaborative symphony. Dr. Denise Fossman says it's best 
Collaboration allows teachers to teach and students to learn. So, synchronized efforts blending the respiratory physiotherapy with diabetes management is very important to uh, in the care management of people suffering from both those conditions. Managing the glucose level positively influences the respiratory outcomes and vice versa. As Helen Keller wisely put it, although the world is full of sufferings, it is also full of overcoming it. A call to action for all warriors facing this dual challenge. And now for a dose of humor in our health journey. Remember, laughter is the best medicine, even in complex health matters. Let's approach our well-being with curiosity and resilience. The journey is collaborative, like symphony, where each note contributes to melody of health and vitality. And there you have it all, the integrate connection between um, chronic lung disease and diabetes management. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more health insights and share your thoughts in the comments below. Until next time, stay healthy, stay happy. Signing off, Devi Sundar.